How does Einstein's equation E is mc squared relate it to the binding energy of a nucleus? Let's do a thought experiment to combine the individual protons and neutrons into one nucleus. What's interesting is that this process results in a loss of mass. You'll find that the individual protons and neutrons have a combined mass that is larger than the nucleus. The difference in mass is called the mass defect. We define mass defect as the difference between the mass of the nucleus and the sum of the mass of its constituent protons and neutrons. We often use the word constituent in nuclear physics because it means the individual parts or the building blocks of something. But where did that little bit of mass go in the process of building the nucleus? According to Einstein's mass energy equivalence, the mass defect is converted into energy. Specifically, it's converted into binding energy. Let's look at an example calculation where we are asked to find the binding energy of a nucleus using its mass defects. We are considering a uranium-235 nucleus, and we are given the mass of the whole nucleus in this question. I'm going to use m subscript nucleus to denote the mass of the nucleus. First, we need to calculate the mass of the constituent protons and neutrons. Let me look up the mass of an individual proton and neutron from my data booklet. Notice that there is a tiny difference between the mass of a proton and a neutron. A uranium nucleus has 92 protons according to the atomic mass number, so the mass of all the protons in a uranium nucleus is 92 times the mass of one proton. The number of neutrons is the mass number subtracts the atomic number. That's 143 neutrons. Multiply that by the mass of one neutron. Their total mass becomes 3.9344 times 10 to the minus 25 kilograms. The next step is to subtract the mass of the nucleus from the constituent. And I want to carry all the significant figures until the very end to reduce any rounding errors. So here we calculate the mass defect to be 0 0.0298 times 10 to the minus 25 kilograms. The last step is the simplest part. E is mc squared. So the binding energy is equal to the mass defect times the speed of light squared. That gives us a binding energy of a uranium nucleus of 2.68 times 10 to the minus 10 joules.